What's the most dystopian thing happening right now that we never thought could happen just 25 years ago? Everything as a service. No software developer sells their packages anymore, you just owe zero forever. Car companies are installing heated seats that you have to pay a monthly fee to us. No one owns music or movies, which just disappear from streaming services at a whim. Even that new gaming machine you purchased is useless without an internet connection and subscription. And all that which you do not own can be taken from you or have the prices jacked up after you're dependent on it. It's the drug dealer philosophy of capitalism. Today someone used deepfake audio of the mayor of London pretending that he wanted to postpone Remembrance Day in solidarity with Palestinians. British police say this is not technically a crime. How miserable we all are in the middle of what ought to be a golden age, with all our technology. A private citizen, Edward Snowden, revealing every single person's phone connection being tapped and we all collectively forgot it and moved on. People have the world's knowledge in their hand and they still choose ignorance. You know in sci-fi movies when somebody buys a beer and the store clerk is like that will be 3,500 credits and you think underscore damn either beer got way more expensive in the future or money became worth way less underscore that's how I feel every time I buy anything now. The speed at which social engineering is taking place and how easy it is for one person to shape opinions. Very dangerous territory. Be careful. The rapid loss of fresh water, coupled with poisonous slash contaminated but widely utilized water sources. Parking lots are opening across the United States for people working full-time jobs who don't make enough to afford rent so they live out of their cars. They're touting this as an expansion of affordable housing. We are in an insect apocalypse. Since the 1990s insect populations have fallen by up to 90% globally due to human-made insecticides, pollution and habitat loss. If the insect population collapses every other animal population will also collapse. I don't have a word for it but many dystopian works focus on the ignorance and resultant stupidity of the general populace. You want to see dystopia in progress? Follow the r slash teachers subreddit. America is rapidly becoming a nation of ignoramuses who will be easily molded to the will of those in power. The increasing income inequality. It's feeling like we're getting a bit closer to a Hunger Games type world. Lawmakers just straight up ignoring things the people voted for, Ohio. OP, you've taken doom scrolling to the next level. Literally asking people for bad news. The rise of the total surveillance state. Of course, well anticipated already in 1948 by Eric Blair, if not much earlier, e.g. Bentham's Panopticon. Edit to copy you slash vagabond 01 mention of Russian author Yevgeny Zamyatin's book, We, 1924, could be considered another precursor to 1984. It's a great and hugely underrated read which I had totally forgotten about. Companies, asterisk cough asterisk Nestle asterisk cough asterisk, stealing water and selling it back to the people they stole it from. Current video ads lead me to believe idiocracy is coming quicker than we thought. You can barely feed two people at McDonald's for under five. The vast number of homeless people, especially veterans. In America, there should be no such thing as homeless veterans. Also in America, homelessness should not be a thing, period. Um, Nazis used to be the bad guys. Well, they still are, but that used to be a unanimously held public opinion.